Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of the Deep End Minecraft SMP. Today, ladies and gentlemen, one thing I have to check, my microphone is working. Should have checked that beforehand, but I just noticed it now that there was something blocking it. But hello, ladies and gentlemen, we're back here on the Deep End SMP. Today's goal is to just finish up the Enderman farm. If we can get that working and get tons and tons upon tons upon tons of glorious ender pearls, I will be a happy boy. I will be. Now, ender pearls aren't as important as they used to be because right now we have the elytra. Did it not explode? Excuse me, game? Because we have the elytra, but still having ender pearls is really, really, really nice. They're, they're good things to have in your inventory at all times. They help you survive, they get you out of weird situations, and also they're just nice to have. So last episode, as you guys saw, I actually threw some wood in here beforehand, like over a stack and a half. We went to the swamp because I have been farming slimes, which I'm probably going to have to do more of today, which I'm not looking forward to. But I've been farming slimes because we need copious amounts of sticky pistons, which we need slime balls for. But I've knocked down just about every tree. I haven't... Okay, I should knock down those as well. But I've knocked down just about every tree over here. The reason being is because I... It's hard to see things in here when there's lots of trees. There's also lots of... I'm gonna get rid of like all of this. I want to make this like the perfect slime farming thing because it's a swamp. No one cares about the swamp. And before any of you say anything like, oh, Megan lives right there. She moved. Don't worry. Also, Megan's coming back to the series, she says, which I'm excited for. She hasn't been on for a while. She's been sick. She's been traveling. But now she wants to get back in and she said she's going to upload next week. So I'm kind of excited to have her back on this. Uh, the, well, I was going to say the series, but that doesn't make sense. Um, I'm probably just going to go and make... Okay, watch this. No, no. Fly! <laughs> Fly, you fools. None of you know that. Why? Why am I not flying? There we go. I wasted so many fireworks there. But this has given me the opportunity to both farm slime balls and gunpowder because I've been killing creepers while we're there. Oh, lag. Ooh, lag. Ooh, kill them. Okay, we're good now. But I'm gonna go and... Let's see. Let's see. Wait. <gasps> I was gonna say let's make pistons. But I'm still missing something. Oh, this game is dumb. I'm missing the easiest part of it. Cobblestone. I have 13. I have 13. I have 13. Okay. All right. We could shake it off. And we can head on over to <laughs> spawn and go to Goodwill and hope that there's some cobblestone there because you need four cobblestone per uh, piston in order to make one. So we're going to need quite a few of that. Also, oh god, Grazer FaceTimed me while I was at, oh my god, all the sugar cane. Grazer FaceTimed me a couple days ago while I was out with friends. And he said he wanted to check my foundation, so I'm a little afraid to see what's in there. So I think we might go do that after this, but please. I know there's lots of dirt in here. Is there any cop? There's. I'll take the one cobblestone. Oh, please. No, I don't need stone this time. I need cobblestone. I have tons of stone. I just... I don't, 15. Okay, we've profited two. <laughs> Uh, gravel's not what I'm looking for. Gravel's really not what I'm looking for. There's not gonna be. Well, actually, there might be. That was. That should be something that Grazer throws in there, like a stack of cobblestone, to help out a little bit. There really doesn't. Oh, let's see if I could do this. There we go. God, I, I I suck at doing that. I've wasted so many fireworks just trying to make that stuff happen, even though I could just easily fly. Fireworks aren't that hard to get, but they're just annoying. Like, having to get the uh, gunpowder is the annoying part. I have millions, well, not millions. I have hundreds of sugarcane, thousands probably even. Easily thousands, actually, now that I think about it. Let's go grab some more gunpowder and see if we can get any more slime balls, because I'm still going to need more of that. I need a lot of stuff. I need cobblestone. I need to go mining. I have enough iron. I just don't feel comfortable wasting it. All. It's not wasting, but using all the iron. Yeah, I was debating about killing that sheep, but I said no to that because sheeps are sh sheep are cute sheeps are cute we've made it up to two stacks of 52 slime balls which is pr honestly pretty good 
Like, I'm pretty happy with that. I'm probably gonna have to go to the swamp at least one more time, but I'm okay with it right now. So what I need to do... It's kind of cobblestone. Last episode, I think I spent like an hour gathering up stone. Now I need to do the same thing with the cobblestone. Let me dump out all this crap and then I gotta go to the fun area of the down below cave system. God, I can't think today either. I'm on a roll. Oh my God, I mentioned this like a minute ago and forgot it. Well, not a minute ago, like t 20 minutes ago. He checked my phone. He left the door. Zine, Zine was ear. Duke 18, ruin your founds. Pay me 15 diam to clean up or offer the cons or suffer the cons. I'm just, I'm just gonna go ahead and get rid of all of these. Oh no. Oh, they're plotting something down here. Oh, guys. <laughs> what are they? I, I, I'm not sure if this was Zine. I seriously thought that... I'm, I'm going to keep talking like that now. Um, I seriously thought that was going to be... Well, it was Grazer. It had to be Grazer. Maybe Zine stopped by. Is is like the... You know, whatever. I need Cobblestone. I'm going to go get Cobblestone. I got free 5 TNT. I'm okay with that. It wasn't a prank as far as I'm aware. I got free stuff for clicking a button five times. So I'm okay with that. I hate my friends. <laughs> I somehow ended up at spawn <laughs> from my base. Didn't do that on purpose, but we're at the Triton farm. Like, right in the middle of this thing, the Triton farm. Didn't expect that, but we got... I don't even want to count that. A lot. I found four ores of diamonds, fortune through them all, and got four diamonds. Do you know how unlikely that is? Me neither. Oh, there's a new shop here at Spawn. It's got a little chocolate bar. Hershey. Hershey's chocolate as the thing. This looks like another. Oh, I was going to say this looks like another Captain Sparkles thing. But wheels fire. One stack equals one diamond. Deal. Thank you. Sick. Very sick. I'm very happy we have those. So that must mean Will's, uh, well, maybe it doesn't mean, but more than likely means that Will's, uh, creeper farm is working. I don't know where it's located at. I want to see it, but I don't know where it is. I don't think this is it. I think this is, is this Zines? Is it? I, I honestly don't know. Yeah, I've, there's like a little... <gasps> Babies, come to me, my children. I have found you. Hello, fellow humans. It is time for you to pass on to the afterlife as I take all of your sticky sliminess. Oh, that sounded really weird, and I regret saying that. With me, uh, I don't need lapis. I have tons of it. We got 29 from that, and you. You will give me four babies. You gave me three. You have failed. Got 38 from that. That's not bad at all. All right. Surprise slimes. I love it. I don't think there's anything else in here. What is this? I thought this was like... Is this like a prank on Zine? I seriously thought this was like where Zine's base... Oh, you know what? It was Delphron. <gasps> Look at that little baby down there. Oh, he's a little baby. Okay, let's get out of here before the baby gets upset. There's a nice little way out of here, too. <laughs> that is kind of cool, actually. <laughs> the, the sugar cane is a uh, door. And also, for all of you that have been fans of my Minecraft stuff for a while, you will know that I love pandas. I have an extreme love for pandas. Merpanda, Panda Kendrix. There was one more that I don't remember. I actually really don't remember. And that makes me feel like a terrible person. The, uh, the the panda that was on Chamber of Iris. But they're coming to vanilla Minecraft. Oh, baby panda, the baby panda sneezed too. I'm excited. And there's bamboo coming as well. That's what the sugar cane, that's why the sugar cane made me think of it. I was going to say bamboo, but I was like, no, it's sugar cane. But there is bamboo coming to Minecraft. There's also a lot of other things coming to Minecraft too, I think. I don't know. I haven't really paid much attention. They're doing an update to 
Taiga biome? Maybe? It's not the... De I don't know what they're doing at Update 2. I'm just... Um, they, the Minecon was this previous weekend and they did stuff for it. Alright, time to make a ton of sticky pistons. This is gonna feel so... So good. Just fantastic in every way, shape, and form. Oh, feels good, man. And now for almost as good of a part. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna go get more slime balls, I guess. All right, this is about to get messy, but this is gonna be the first one that we make. I don't know how well I'm gonna make this. I'm a little bit afraid. I forgot redstone. God dang it. Ah. Okay, everything I, I, I think I have everything I need. Do I have the pistons? I do. I think we're good. So this is what it should end up looking like. Just going across here. I shouldn't be worrying about this. I'm just gonna make that because I don't want things spawning up here. I'm gonna do that on this side as well. But basically, we just wanna make sure that the only place that mobs, or the Endermen, there's not mobs, there's just Endermen, can spawn on is the, uh, this platform right here. God, I, I, I'm good at speaking today. It's one of those days. But all of the, this is gonna be the block underneath the piston. We're gonna have them all be stone slabs, which makes it a little bit more difficult, but it makes it look better. Link jumped up on my lap, so I'm uncomfortable for a second as he's going behind me on my chair. So over here, we're gonna place the pistons on top, and then we're gonna put a block. Oh God, I'm scared of falling off the edge. A block on top as well. Let's do this so the Enderman can't go anywhere as well. I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna use, I mean, we could do this straight up, I think. I think, we'll try it out. We'll see if we could just straight up use one stone slab. It should be enough just to push them over. The reason why I'm putting this across, I don't have to go that far out. I kind of just have to go right here. Did I do that on that side? I did do that on that side. Okay, we can get rid of this block. Okay, we should be good now. And then we put the redstone repeaters off changing with redstone into here so we don't get any of the um what's it called these things mixed up it also makes it so that the redstone uh will be going into the block with the pressure plates so here now you can see that's going in there i'm gonna jump over because i can just very easily get pushed off okay that's what just happened to me is not gonna happen to the enderman because this is two and a half blocks high that was scary <laughs> two and a half blocks high so that the enderman can't fit through there that's why it's all two and a half blocks up they are three blocks high so it makes it a lot easier god i hate working on here i it doesn't help that i'm afraid of heights in like real life and it does actually trans over to transfer over to minecraft weirdly enough it does 100 percent, and i can't explain why okay so one more pressure plate and we're good to go i'm gonna make a ton actually we're gonna make 20. i know math there we go so that is one side done i'm gonna do it to the opposite side and now how do we do this so this is two huh okay so one up here and then we should just be able to do that all the way across i think that's all i need to do right I don't know. I'm going to see what it looks like. All right. We're finishing up this last bit. I did one more level above here. It's not perfect yet. Okay, yeah, it's really not perfect yet. I got one more thing to do after this. But up on top, there's going to be other spawns for, or places for them to spawn, which is going to be annoying. But I need to do so, I need to fix some things really quick, namely right here. Um, I did the math incorrectly. So in all the places I've started putting, like, each side, three up, three on each, if that made any sense to anybody out there. Uh, how do I get over there? I would like to go around, please. <laughs> um. Ah. Uh, I should be able to. Yeah, I can go on top of there. Okay, we're good. We're just gonna lose a stone slab. It's whatever. I don't need that stone slab. But now these should work. It's not gonna be perfect because obviously I haven't blocked off the top. This is gonna be scary going down here. But we could just go like this. This is how you dig straight down. You go in between places. Perfect. And you can see where it goes down until that point. Perfect. We just go down there. Sorry, I'm doing a lot of thinking at the same time. But now what we should be able to do is go on the bottom. 
I need to do... I need to, like, half-slab the rest of the walkway as well. We'll worry about that another time. Okay, now where... Okay, it's not there. It should be right here. Perfect. See, that's how you get down nice and safe. I could also just glide, which I probably will start doing now, because that makes a lot more sense. But there should be... Okay, mm not looking too promising so far. Let's go ahead and start getting rid of this walkway and see if things start spawning. I have no idea how this is going to go, but I've officially, I've knocked over so many Endermen by clearing this path. I'm really hoping that this works. I don't expect to see a lot. I just need to get confirmation that one spawned up there and fell down. That's what I need. I'm waiting to see. <laughs> I'm so scared. I'm just waiting to see if any Endermen fall down. I, I mean, it's pitch dark in the back, so it's hard to tell. But I'm not seeing anything. No. Why is there just one not, vine just not growing up there? That's bothersome. No, they're just not going up, huh? Luckily, there's an easy way to get up here. Whee! They're just not spawning up here. What? Like, they're not spawning anywhere. Are they all still spawned back over there? We're so far away. Wait, what? Okay, so from this side, we are at 370. Huh. All right, 370 like I said. Let's see. I thought we'd be out of render distance and they wouldn't be able to spawn over here. Maybe I have to go farther back. I mean, that's like 250 blocks away. From where I'll be standing. Over here. God, this is so fast. Hang on, let's try something. I'm gonna get to the end over here. There we go. Gotta get to the end over here. Oh, Jesus, I nearly fell off. I'm gonna stand here for a second. I don't see anything. Disconnect. Give it a moment. Sorry, I had to eat my Sharpie. Jess and Megaron, by the way. Respawn back on... Really? Why? Like... I don't understand. Is it because there's other players on right now? Oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me they don't spawn on pressure plates anymore. I think we're out far enough now. If I put blocks like this and put a pressure plate, it's just an oak pressure plate, on these let's do a little bit more just in case will they spawn like I don't know how to make them spawn easier like I, I mean like I don't know if this is gonna work or not uh, you know let's try let's try I hate this idea but I'm gonna do it Are they gonna spawn everywhere but the pressure plates? If I go out, like over here. I think I just saw one. Did I? No. Huh. Let's try doing this. Uh, going a little bit further out. This is just gonna be something I test out. We're gonna go like 400 blocks, or not 400 blocks away, like 40 blocks away. That should be more than enough. Save and quit and come back on. No, not the deep end. I need to go on single player. New world. Creative world. Please work. Please work. Please work. Help an H-bomb out, please. I mean, let's do... Okay. Well, there's nothing spawning anywhere, so that... I don't know if that's good or bad. Look at how tiny it looks from here. It's so minuscule. If we go in closer. Nothing. Hmm. How can I make Enderman spawn? Like other than use, I don't, I don't know. I'm gonna test out a few more things. I might just go and keep creating it. I don't wanna keep creating it actually. 
Like the only Enderman we saw spawn was on a non-pressure plate, which is what annoys me. But now there's nothing spawning over here at all. I don't know what to do. So we're slowly going into the void. Wait, maybe I am actually slowly going into the void. Oh my god, there it is. I, I couldn't find where the stupid farm was. Um, but what I want to do is, a lot of you mentioned uh, me going... I should have done this earlier. I don't know why I forgot about it again. A lot of you mentioned me uh, me going to uh, Zine's Ender... Or not Enderman Farm. Dang it, Slime Farm. I did not know he had one. So thank you guys for telling me that. That makes my life a little bit easier. We're going to go grab a lot of those. I wanted to go a bit further out. I don't see any Endermen up here, which is good. God dang it. Ah, let me land, let me land, let me land, let me land. There we go. There's nothing spawning up there. Like anything, period. Like that's not in render distance. Am I missing something? We're gonna test something. I've done enough testing. You know, I'm gonna test all of this off camera and figure out what I'm doing wrong. Cause this, oh no. Okay, so if they don't spawn on pressure plates, there's something that we could do instead, which is less efficient, but it still works just as well. It's going to be a, oh God, I forgot the name of it. Um, tripwire hook, that's what it is. So the thing that we could do is have a tripwire hook go all across here instead of it being pressure plates, which I don't think there'll be any issues with string that they can't spawn on. Hi, I just looked at you and you did not attack me. Thank you for that. Um, but it'll look exactly the same. The issue would be, it would require less redstone, would be the fact, actually we use a lot less pistons. Ooh, I like this idea a little bit more already because we could have like one piston do like everything. It's gonna be all of these blocks go at the same time because I'm not gonna be able to dif differentiate between which block pushes. So let's go test that out at home and see if we can make it. Good news, the Enderman just fell down. While I was going to go message Zine. God dang. Ah! Oh! Ah! <laughs> ah! Oh, thank God we're here. Hi, buddy. Nope. Not the perfect height. Not the perfect height. Almost the perfect height. I think we're one block off. All right. Well, we got to test that part at least. So we're getting there with the, the vines. Which is somewhat good. This should work if I'm correct. Okay, it's triggered, and now, did not work. <laughs> okay, that's news to me. I didn't know that you can't uh, put it on top of pistons anymore. Really? Yeah, no, that broke it. Okay. Really? Now this should work. <laughs> Perfect, okay. It's not perfect. So the reason why this isn't perfect is because this takes more spawning ground away from the mobs because when it was just like one individual piston or whatever pushing out, all the other uh, slabs could spawn Endermen during that time period. So it's a little bit worse, but it's not the end of the world. This is fairly straightforward as well. Just now we need a lot of string. Oh, I need a lot of string. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back to the swamp. I don't think. Wait, no. I think Funny Crew has a, a, a spider farm. Uh, I messaged Zine in case anyone's wondering. I we're good for slimes right now, but in the future I'm gonna need that. So I think if he responds to me, he's working right now. I know that for a fact because it's Monday. So I don't think he's gonna respond to me. But I'm gonna go see if I can find that spider farm. I'm almost positive they had one. I heard someone talking about it before. I think they have a spider farm. Test worked. Got it to work. Good on you, H. You did great. These guys all spawned on string, so it should, in theory, not make a difference about tripwire hooks. And then beat a test to tripwire hooks. Yep, it's all string. Figured something out. I don't know how I didn't realize this where the slime farm would be. Zine made it, and literally earlier on this episode, I saw the slimes. They're still right there. This is a slime chunk. I, I don't know why I didn't put, t like that was literally two and two together. Like I don't have to be a detective to figure that out. God dang, it's underneath here somewhere. All right, Zine mapped it out for me. Go to the house in the new Mesa, which I'm assuming is this, is the new Mesa. 
I'm assuming this is the house. I'm, I'm just gonna guess. <laughs> hang a left, straight. Wait, hang a left in the house. Okay, so this is the house. I'm assuming down here. You can either go to the left and just grab some sli a high link. Oh, this thing. Oh, that's a fun thing. Okay, they're dying down there. Yep, this is the slime farm. Now, how do we get down is the question. That probably... I mean, I could take those, theoretically, and I don't think he would care. But I kind of want to see the bottom of it if I can get to it. it. Looks like we go down here. Don't die. Thank you. Um, okay, this is where... Oh, wow! Oh, Alright. Is this supposed to... This doesn't look like it's on right now. I can't really see how it's working, but it looks like he's supposed to fill that up with slime balls, and then when it gets wait, when it gets filled up, it goes somewhere else and takes it to a chest and it unloads on it. <gasps> That's kind of cool. That's actually really cool. It's well done if he did that. I'm assuming he did that. I don't know that for, for that a, as a fact, but there's a lot of slime balls in here, and I'm going to take as much as I can hold. Speaking of which, I'm going to take more as well. There we go. I'm a happy boy now. I'm gonna take more. I'm gonna take more. <laughs> okay, we're good now. Thank you, Zine. Appreciate it, buddy. I wish I could see more of the slime farm. It looked I built a slime farm in the cube and it looked very similar to it. It was kind of like layers on layers of spawning pads for them. And then on the bottom left where this was, they would all congregate over there. Because the cool thing about slimes is they always have to be walking around and they always go in one direction unless they see another character. So in this case, okay, over here as well, it looks like he has another one. Yep. So in majority of the cases, they would go to a wall, keep pushing themselves into the wall, and then like if they're going this way, they would slowly keep edging their way over, fall in there. My way was I had water push them into one specific location where they would all drown and die. And then I would pick up the slime balls from there. But this looks a little different. I wish I could see more. I'm kind of scared, so I'm just not going to. But it looks like the, I don't know what that block is called. The magma block from the nether destroys them. Destroy them. Um, it kills them all. And it looks like a hopper underneath them picks it up or something along those lines. I don't fully know. There was also iron golems there, which makes me think that there's a possibility that the iron golems kill them. I don't know if that's a thing or not. It could be. I don't know. I'll ask him about it next time I see him. But anyways, guys, that's all the time for today's episode. We're already past 25 minutes, and I apologize for that. I try not to make them go on too long, but I don't think the majority of people care too much if they go on a little bit longer than I intend to. Next episode, we're finishing it up. I have to take a redesign, which is unfortunate. And I need to go... Oh! Comment... Why did I go face first into that? I kind of, like, focused on going up to the camera. Comment if you guys know if there's a spider farm. And if you do know, try and give me a detailed map of how to get to it if you see someone another comment with a detailed comment on how to get to it thumbs that up but anyways guys thank you so much for watching i hope you did enjoy if you did be sure to leave a like get out of here <gasps> you know, go ahead.